Hey everybody, it's Benny One and I'm back at you with another trailer reaction, everybody. And we got the damn first official trailer for the prequel Game of Thrones show that takes place 200 years before Game of Thrones. And that is the House of Dragons. Oh, I'm excited for this shit. It's going to follow the novel that was released and everything. It's going to be about when the Targaryens were reigning and in charge of Westeros. And they had dragons galore. Like, you thought there was dragons in Game of Thrones. There's going to be way more dragons in this shit, everybody. So, we got about a minute and 20. Not quite 20 minutes. A minute and 20 seconds, Jesus Christ, of a trailer. So, it's an official trailer. Shit's going to be on HBO Max sometime next year. Let's dive right into the trailer, everybody. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. I appreciate it. Like the video, everybody. You guys are rock. You're awesome. Let's dive into the trailer. Let's go. I want to read the book. So. Two hundred years. Gods. There's the hand. Kings. Fire. Dreams didn't make us kings. Ooh, look at the throne. I am. Look at it. Dragons did. <laughs> yes. Super stoked about this shit. It's 2022. We don't have a date yet. Yes, everybody. Hell yes. I um I'm excited for that show. I I loved Game of Thrones all the way up until literally the last three episodes of season eight. I thought, yeah, season seven things kind of started to because eh, they were running out of source material. And then the first three episodes I thought were pretty good in season eight, but damn it, the last three episodes of season eight of Game of Thrones, what a bummer was not a huge fan of how they ended the show. Um, so I'm excited about this shit. Because the Targaryens were really screwed up. Like, they did... When they were running shit, when they were in charge and they had the throne, like, they're, they are they messed up. They were messed up what they did. They were brutal. They were savage to people. So And they had dragons. So I'm excited. I'm ready. I hope we get a date soon. Hopefully it's not too far into next year. So, all right, everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed that reaction. Thanks for watching. And I'll be catching you on the tube later because I have spoken.